guys, what's up? Um, it's Mojo here, back with another app review. Um, I was thinking about doing an app called Where's My Water. Um, let me scroll over so you guys can find, see it. Um, it is third from the left with the alligator with the shower head thing on it. Um, the one with the alligator. Um, or it's right next to the frontline commando, right to the left of it. Frontline commando is all the way to the right. Um, it's one to the left of that. Um, let me go to the app store. Might have to reload. Yep, it has to refresh. Here it is. Um, I already pre-searched it. Um, it is on the top 25. I think it is fourth, third or fourth. Um, fourth on top page, top 25 on the app store. It's right there. Um, if you guys want to find it. <clears throat> Alright, let's get into it. Um, there's the icon if you didn't see it. Um, but where's my water? Like I said, um, it's made by Disney. It's got a four star, almost a five star. It's got a little over a thousand six hundred ratings. Supported by Game Center. Um, let's look at the in-app purchases. Um, Mystery Duck, Cranky Story, Locksmith, One Lock, um, All Swampy Unlocked, All Mystery Unlocked, All Cranky Unlocked. Um, pretty much levels. Um, I'll go over the levels. I'll go over Cranky and Swampy. Swampy is $5 and Cranky is another $2. And then the new levels is $5, $2, pretty much a dollar to $5. If you want to lock all the levels, um, limited time sale. It is on sale. I didn't get it on sale. I've had this app for a while now. Um, to celebrate the release of the new Mystery Duck level pack, um, I showed you that in the top in app purchases. Um, I think it was a dollar um, in the in app purchases. A dollar or two dollars, I think. Um, but I'm pretty sure it's a dollar. Um, we dropped the price for a limited time only. Um, enjoy 100 levels now, and then there's 100 more coming soon in the next update. Where's My Water is a hit Disney app everyone is playing now with over 350 levels. Um, 350 levels is pretty insane. Um, that you have to like go through and get all the ducks for like in each levels. Um, some of them are pretty challenging. Some of them are pretty easy, and you can just pretty much see like where to go but some of them are tricky um <clears throat> here are some top like app reviewers um IGN they gave them the editor's choice award um slide to play game of the month um kids world perfect game to play on the go um now let's actually get into the actual like app itself um Where's My Water is a challenging physics-based puzzle puzzler complete with vibrant graphics, intuitive controls, and a sensational soundtrack. To be successful, you need to be clever and to keep an eye out for foliage, which is like algae and stuff, toxic ooze, triggers and traps. Um, um, now it has iCloud support to synchronize your hard-earned progress across multiple iOS devices. Um, which means one game on multiple devices. Um, like, I have this game on my iPod, and I could go on iCloud and transfer it over to my iPhone um, if I wanted to do that. I probably will, just to have it on there, <coughs> which is pretty nice, because then you don't have to do all the levels over again if you download it on a different device. Um, there's three stories in the game. Um, which means three separate games, more than 350 total puzzles, plus free updates. Um, here are, I think, yeah, here's two stories. Um, Swampy Story is pretty much like just the basic levels, pretty easy. Just to get you started out in the game, not too hard. Um, some of them are pretty challenging, but some of them aren't like insane that it's going to take a couple minutes to... Do it. You'll probably get him in a couple minutes. Um, 
pretty much what it's about. Swamp of the Alligator lives in the sewers under the, under the city. Um, he's different from the other alligators, as you can see in the story once you play the game. Um, he's curious, friendly, and loves taking a nice long shower after a day of after a hard day at work. Um, the other guys, the other alligators, can't talk today. Have damaged his plumbing and disrupted the water flow. Um, help Swampy by guiding the water to a shower. And Swampy stories play ten theme chapters over two hundred levels. So just there's just two hundred levels in this just this first story. Um, <clears throat> and then there's an, another three fifty on top of two hundred. So that so there's like a ton of levels in this game. Um, unless there's just 200 and, like, there's 350 in total, so there's pretty much half the levels in Swampy Story, I guess. Or it's 200 levels plus 350 on top of that, which would be pretty insane. But, I think it's just, like, just 200 levels out of 350. So, pretty much all the levels are in, <coughs> just in Swampy, just in Swampy Story, um, out of 350 um, plus you like I said you collect swampy ducks and shower items collect new puzzles and bonus levels um, they're all the what are they called shower items they're hit out hidden like through like all the levels and you have to like once you're in the level you can see them they'll like shimmer or something like through the dirt and you remove the dirt and it pops up and then you have to collect three of them to unlock the bonus level. Like three of them in the same chapter. They're hidden out through the levels in the whole chapter. Um, and then you unlock bonus levels and then just gives you more levels. Um, um, Cranky story. Um, Cranky is the toughest alligator around. He has worked up an appetite for sabotaging Swampy's water supply. Um, he eats anything, especially all the rotting, disgusting junk found in the swamps. Crank, cranky will not eat vegetables, however. And now his food is covered in it with a vegetable-like algae. Um, use the dirty purple water to clean off Cranky's plate so he can eat. Um, I'm just going to pretty much skim over it. Cranky is tough and his puzzles... <coughs> Cranky is tough and sore as puzzles. Um, try five levels for free and test your skills with more than 80 levels for an additional in-app purchase. Um, I showed you, I think it was $5. It was 3 or $5. I, I'll go back up after this. Um, lost levels. The collection of levels from Swampy's other adventures is always growing and always free. So there's more levels there. Um, it doesn't say how many are there, so there's probably a little bit, probably 20 to 40 levels, maybe, I don't know, um, but there's more levels there, um, this game has amazing lifelike fluid physics, like with the water, go with the flow, swipe, slosh, and splash to guide fresh water, dirty water, and ooze to increasingly challenging scenarios, um, Sometimes you have to be like multitasking, do another thing, and then swipe down and do something else. Um, so sometimes it gets like pretty challenging and it gets pretty insane. Um, sometimes you might need someone else to help you um, if it gets too insane, but I haven't had that happen. Um, collectibles challenging, collectibles challenges and bonus levels. Sorry, I can't. I can't talk today, but. Um, Collect swampy shower items and collect cranky challenges to unlock bonus levels. Um, try ducks in each chapter and tap around for secret levels and even more surprises. Um, visit facebook.com slash where's my water for hints, tips, and secrets. Sometimes they post where all the secrets are on their Facebook with screenshots. Um, so you just go on that. Like the app, pick, find the level like they're talking about, and then find the secret. 
Um, every drop counts, where's my water? A fresh new puzzle filled with good, clean gaming fun. Um, here's some screenshots. They're actually up and down now. They're not side to side. So you guys can actually probably see them, which is kind of nice. I like how they made them up and down. Um, 20 new mud levels. Um, you're... <coughs> Sorry about the cough. I'm still a little sick. Um, but there are 20 new mud levels. Um, these are probably the most challenging ones because your water doesn't sit on top of the mud. It kind of like washes away the mud and it can waste like your water really quick because it just doesn't like go through it kind of like seeps into it and gets rid of the mud um just like in real life um which is pretty cool like they're challenging and fun um passes the time that type of thing um let's scroll over um introducing the mystery duck mode um mystery ducks levels are pretty insane there's like one duck but it, like it's like a magician duck i think and you can see it right there on the bottom left that's what it looks like um it's a magician like duck and it like teleports like back it just like teleports around the map and it makes it more challenging and a little more hard but it's actually like pretty amazing it's really fun um that they introduced that and it's really challenging which i like um but it's gets kind of hard when it's teleporting really fast once you get into the um, higher levels um, there are over 200 challenging puzzles just in the first like map um, the swampy what's it called let me scroll for a second swampy story there's 200 levels just in that um, there's what the swampy ones are kind of like. They're not like super hard. Um, they're pretty easy. Um, pretty much just basic levels. Um, here's swampy again. Um, there's the toxic ooze that gets rid of your water. Um, there's the uh, algae that's right there. Um, I'll talk a little bit about like all the stuff that you face um like that light green like the dark ne the light like neon green i think it's what color it is what i think the color is that neon green stuff is a toxic ooze um if your water touches that it completely it like evaporates it and gets rid of it um all that green stuff that are on the rocks pretty much the same color as the toxic ooze that's algae um if your water touches that it sucks up the water and pretty much just starts growing and if you touch it too much it'll grow around that nozzle on the left and it'll stop the water flow and you have to redo the level um, um, here's the bonus collections and surprises um, there's the shower stuff they were talking about the shower um, collectibles um, you collect three of them and meet Swampy and then you unlock a bonus level um, <clears throat> I think I've collected one through, one through five, I think. Um, they're pretty hard to find. Some of them are easy, some of them are hard. Some of them they hid, like, really good. And then some of them are just out in the open. You can pretty much see them. They're kind of have a glow to them. Um, some of them are pretty hard, but some of them are pretty easy. But that's what the bonus levels look like. Um, oh, one more thing. Um. Like those ducks right there in the top top left, um, you have to collect those um, to like move on to the next level um, and to unlock new levels inside that actual chapter. You have to collect so many ducks to, and then they'll let you move on. Um, that's pretty much like the objective of the game is to collect all the ducks without killing the ducks because if this like toxic ooze touches the duck it'll kind of kill the duck and it'll put like a crossbones on the top left and you have to pretty much redo the level <coughs> but what I do is I just go through the levels and get as many ducks as I can and then I'll go back through and at because I know the level and I've done it before it's kind of easier to 
get all the ducks on the second try, then doing it all in one try the first time, not knowing what the level's about. Um, but that's just my tip. Um, do it like do it like the first time. Get as many ducks as you can, and then once you complete the whole chapter and you do all the levels, then go back through and get all the ducks on three. Get like. I said that wrong, but just go back through and get uh, all three ducks on the second try because you know what the level's about, and it'll be much easier, but that's just my tip. Um, here's some of the reviews um, about Where's My Water. Um, I really like this game. It's it's awesome and added, and added so many more levels. Um, there is a lot of levels after the last update. Um, so addicting, this game is one of the best that you can buy. Um, I think it's pretty amazing. I really love this app, but the updates are priced too high. I bought the Mystery Duck, Cranky Story, and Where's My Perry, but now the prices are too high. Any update over $2, I won't buy unless you lower the prices. Um, I, don't, I don't know what that person's talking about. The prices are like 5 to $2. Um, that's not that bad. If they were like $15, for like a dollar app, I would understand, but they're not like insane. Um, but <clears throat> I don't know, understand what that person's talking about, or they just want cheap apps. Um, but very fun, totally love this game. Must have super addictive. Um, I love this game so much, but ever since I updated, it's been crashing. I haven't been able to play it yet. Please fix it. Um, I've never had that happen. Um, I think it's probably because you don't have enough RAM or space on your iPod to run like the extra stuff that goes on in the background. Um, that That's probably the only time I had something crash. If I have too much stuff on my iPod or my iPhone, um, then it, it'll crash and kick me out. And then you just have to go through and figure out what app is like taking all the RAM or the extra stuff and then delete it and then play this game and then once you get tired of it delete it or <clears throat> that's what I, well that yeah that's what I do um if I have an app that is like hog in memory and it's really big um I'll delete it and then write it down on something and go back to it and then play this game and beat it or just leave it on there until I beat it, but have it written down just so when I beat this game, then I can delete this game and then keep all my achievements and everything that I get and then delete it and then go back to the one that I previously had and then download that game again and delete this one. And then you shouldn't have the RAM issue, but if you have like a lot of um, city apps that are hogging RAM and taking up memory, um, I would delete those too, but <clears throat> that's just my tip, um, pretty much all these games run on megabytes and how much memory and stuff you have, um, my iPod isn't really that big, it's only, uh, what is it, 8 gigabytes I think, pretty much the smallest iPod you can get on the 4th generation, um, <clears throat> and I've never had stuff crash, um, you just got to be careful what you download off of Cydia. Um, if they're RAM hungry, I wouldn't download them. Or only download the stuff that doesn't... Well, you can download the stuff from Cydia that... The apps that are RAM hungry, but... Disable some of the stuff in the app that you download. that So it won't gobble up as much RAM. Um, I sometimes have to do that. But those are the reviews. Um, tell a friend... You can tell them about it. Um, there's the gift the app thing I was talking about in the last two videos. Um, you click that and you can gift, gift someone the app. Um, I don't know if you have to buy it to gift it. Um, I think you have to buy it first to gift the app. And then I don't think you have to buy it again. But you might have to buy it again. I don't, I've never gifted an app so I don't know. Um, the company is Walt Disney. Um, Updated June 28th, 2012, so pretty, pretty recently. Um, I think it was pretty much last month. Um, 
So it's been a little while, but not too long. Um, version 1.7.0. Um, the size is a little big. Um, it's not too big. Um, as you can see, I have 46.7 megabytes. Um, plus, as you can see on the top, um, I still have 41 megabytes. That's just my memory. <coughs> but I'm not running like a huge theme right now. Um, I have different themes that will knock that down to probably 20 or something. But then I just have to free up some memory. Um, plus, they have app support too. You click that and you get contact with the people that made the app, which is pretty amazing. Like if you have a crashing issue or a problem with the app, you click app support, message them. They reply to you in not that long at all. Um, I had a problem with the app. Oh, it was that Plague Inc. app. Um, they have that app support, and I clicked that, and I wrote that it was crashing every time. And that then I got an email probably an hour or two hours later after I sent it, which is pretty quick. Um, and they told me that um, that they were coming out with another update um, probably the next day or so. And that, that should probably fix my, like, crashing issues and everything. Um, and then I downloaded the update. Um, <coughs> I do go over this in my Plague um, app review. It's on my channel, too. But back to the story. Um, I don't want to take too long, but I just, like, I downloaded the update for Plague Inc. And it still crashed. And I was like, I thought that it would fix the crash. So I messaged them back and they said um, that it should have fixed the crash and I downloaded the update and I told them yeah I updated it but it still crashes and they told me is like my device jailbroken or not I told them yeah and they said well do you have any RAM hungry um, like tweaks or stuff on your iPod or whatever device you're using and I said I don't know I can look and I did all that um, took all the RAM hungry stuff or changed some settings around to make it so it didn't um, like destroy my RAM and take all my RAM that I used to play games um, and this was on my iPod um, I messaged them and everything and they told me um, <coughs> After I did all that to reboot my iPod or iPhone or whatever, and I rebooted it, and that pretty much like fixed all the crashing problems. Um, I've never had a, uh, it crash again. Um, so big ups to like Plague uh, Plague Inc's um, support. Um, they're pretty amazing. Um, they'll help you with pretty much anything you have a problem with their app, crashing issues, anything. Um, where's my water? Um, I think I had one problem. Um, it was right when I downloaded it. Um, I downloaded it right after an update came out, and I didn't get the update. Um, so I messaged the app, the app support, and I told them that I downloaded it right when I got the right when they came out with the update, and it didn't update with a new version. And they sent me like the update like to my iPod, which is pretty amazing. Um, they just sent me the they didn't say anything. They just said, oh, we'll just send you the update right now. And probably in, I don't know, 15, 20 minutes, I had went to the app store and downloaded the update. And it worked. It works probably perfectly fine ever since. But where's my water app support? It's pretty amazing. Um, some of the games, the app support isn't good at all. Um, if that happens, I would just delete the app. I wouldn't even worry about it but that's pretty much it on my story stories of apps I guess but um this is pretty much the end of the app review um <coughs> of where's my water by Disney um if you guys have any questions about this app or different apps that you want me to review or any type of things like that on on those lines um Plus, if you guys want me to review an app, like usual, leave in the comments. Um, let me know what the app is. Give me a description about it. That type of thing. Um, I should be posting some videos then, like soon. Um, 
I did get a new PC, like I said, a, last month or the month before. Um, I think I got it last month. Um, I got Minecraft. Um, I can stream that if you guys want me to see that. Um, I have Grand Theft Auto for PC. I have Need for Speed World. Um, most Wanted, Need for Speed Most Wanted. Um, or if you guys have any PC games that you want me to like re review or like commentate over or any type of stuff like that, um, <coughs> that type of thing I can do that because I finally got a mic. Um, I can do that type of stuff. Um, plus I got fraps on my my laptop, so I can do commentary now over PC stuff. Um, uh, I'll try to get Mon for three for PC um, since I don't have a TV right now. Um, but that's pretty much it on the app. Where's my water? Um, if you guys, like I said, want to see an app, um, want to see like a specific app, leave them in the comments. And if you guys want me to do videos like this again, um, please leave a like and support me um because i i like doing these um these are fun um reviewing apps giving you guys a great review um i like doing this other than ps3 and that type of stuff which i like ps3 and stuff but this is just a different how do you say it um different avenue i guess than just playing and uploading cod and all that type of stuff just to get a different variety on my channel like I said but I'm done rambling about everything um, if you guys like the video please um, give it a like and I'll do more um, if you guys are new to the channel um, please subscribe hit the button um, go to my channel check out my other videos um, uh, I post mom for three pretty much not all the CODs, um, I have all the CODs, but I can't record all of them. Um, I have different games, um, I'll probably start posting PC and app reviews from now on until I get a new TV, like I said. Um, if you want to join Team MVK, um, I have a video on my channel, or I can leave the link in the description if you want me to, or just comment on the video, tell me you want to join. And I'll get you the info. Um, I am an administrator on the Team MVK website now. Um, I have all the privileges. Um, I have all that stuff now. Um, big shout out to J30 and Buckshots for the promotion on the website. Um, it means a lot. Um, I've been in Team MVK ever since Black Ops. The close to the end of Black Ops. Um, if you guys didn't know. Um, <laughs> and I got admin privileges uh, a couple days ago. But if you guys want to join Team MVK, um, just send me a message. Um, I won't be on PS3, but I can message one of the leaders and you can add them. Um, or someone else in the MVK, I can have you add them until I get my PS3 and stuff working again. Um, well, my TV, my PS3 is fine. But yeah, this has been like... A pretty long commentary I guess but which is fine but if you guys want to join like I said leave a comment I'll give you the inform information in information information but <clears throat> that's pretty much it on the app where's my water um, leave a like if you want me to keep doing them um, subscribe if you're new to the channel um, I post videos once when I can. Um, I will be posting um, more. Um, just let me know what you guys want to see. PCs. I can record some PC games with commentary, or I can do more app reviews. Just let me know in the comments. But this has been Where's My Water App Review. Um, I'll just see you guys in the next video. Peace out, guys.